when you prepare a fashion exhibition, it is quite difficult. It's not like when you have a painting and you put it on, on the wall, you hang it on the wall. You have to really uh, build a, a form because uh, the garment uh, naturally has nearly no shape. And you have to recreate the body of the woman who was wearing uh, this uh, outfit. Because with the, the person inside the garment, you have also the makeup, the hair uh, dressing, the haircut, uh, the way uh, the person uh, was behaving with the, the garment. For the Japanese exhibition, we are using uh, two uh, techniques. One is uh, the stockman uh, dressmaker form. The other technique we are using is uh, what we call the invisible uh, form. And it is made with a material called Foshep. Uh, it's a great material that uh, you can really um, mold, sculpt, uh, following the shape of the garment. And at the end, you will uh, cut uh, every part that are visible in order to have this idea of, of a dress which is floating in the space. And you see the result, it's great because it is looking like a sculpture. Many fashion designers uh, were, are, are saying that they want it to be a sculpture. The invisible uh, forms are helping the imagination of the, the visitor. Uh, he can really try to figure out which woman uh, was wearing uh, this because he is not, uh, uh, he's not uh, uh, disturbed by a mannequin who will uh, have some arms, head, face, which was really, uh, which is far away what it was uh, at, at that time.